everybody out in here and this is Addicted to Hustle. So today's video, we're actually going to cover something from Froggy Flips, the soy pie video. Show off your pile of death. So without further ado, here's mine. So as you can already get a little glimpse here, we have quite a bit of stuff. Now, this is a eight by 10, I wanna say, or a 10 by 12 uh, storage unit. Now, over here, this is stuff we use for the flea market and stuff over here like that. So I don't wanna count that use space because a lot of that's either personal or things like that. So, but outside of here, I have little shelvings up. So let's get into it and let's see where it's at in here. All right, so I've actually pulled out a lot of this stuff and we actually wanna reorganize a lot of it and I'm going through with the current climate conditions everything that needs to be sold or like we're, we're selling a lot of puzzles and things like that so i pulled those out um but we've got all kinds of stuff from where we're we closed down our store at a thrift store so we are in the middle of going through it all i mean i got all kinds of stuff from imagine x fingerlings all kinds of stuff here collectibles i even got a brand new headset from rig the 400 hs from xbox i got a random you know, m m sitting here on his motorcycle ready to cruise the world the usa um but yeah as you can see we got all kinds of stuff it's stacked up here and let's see in here some more fingerlings got an old ps1 i gotta go through um now in this box there's actually more of them and i think i have one of it here um there is a bunch of these star wars figures these little collectible mounted pieces and inside of them is a thing of underwear so not bad we get about five six bucks a piece for those now forgive me if you think a lot of this is unorganized i actually just moved a lot of our shelves out so i could redo the hop office at the house so as we were moving so trying to keep it together as best as possible but it's actually going through being sorted this week but i figured now would be a great time to show you before and then we'll do after so here's a few more things i got a spawn characters more star trek pieces some old sky busters if anyone remembers these these are the late 80s early 90s these are the solid metal ones we used to tell people your kids would use them like ninja stars all right and as you see a lot of this is stuff that right now is not going to be selling per se because of our current climate conditions and the stay at home orders and in quarantine. But as I start selling more of this stuff, I've actually noticed a lot of this stuff is moving on Mercari. Just all kinds of cool little toys, collectibles. Even got some old 90s Spawn characters. Oh, he's so cool. I even got over here, I got some Wonder Woman down here. And then one of my favorite things is this whole thing here of Pop. And different collectibles um, we have metals collectibles like i have a cat woman here oh wrong side you know just cool little pieces like this kingdom parts a lot of stuff like i said we were in our unit when we were selling at, at the flea market at our big booth and i actually have to hurry up and get these listed as well um, i have a working sega genesis dvd players um one of the cool big pops here trash compactor escape scene from star wars i mean we have all kinds of collectibles some are brand new a lot of them are 99 something percent of them are brand new uh, this is a cool piece so i can show this off to you and this is star wars kylo ren but he is a pretty big figure and i don't know if i can do this one-handed we will see Oh, got it. And let's see if he still turns on. I think his battery might be dead. But his sword lights up, so we'll get enough on that one. Let's see, what else can I show off? I'll have little bins of miscellaneous little stuff. Some Lego pieces. Some fresh metal. But yeah, this is pretty much what we have left to go through um 
we actually estimated when we bought this thing at over about between 10 and 14,000. And that was just being conservative of all the collectible toys. I mean, there's all of these toys in the back rows. I mean, I've already sold maybe a third of what's been in here. I got rows and rows and rows of stuff. Um, we got some cool little, these are cool. The Hulk in the different colors. Let's see, I got him in the yellow. Got him in green. Got him even in the red. Oh, even have the blue one, the orange one, and the purple one back there as well. So I'm, I think these are doing all right. Oh, this guy's pretty cool. John Cena. You don't see me. I'm talking about old Dench's spawn and different characters in, in this box here. Didn't even open this one till now. But check this out. All these old Spawn characters. He's cool. Got uh, old Cynthia. Cynthia Hellglow. That one's actually pretty pretty cool and desirable. Let's see here. Purgatory. Okay. We got all kinds of stuff we've we've got through that. And yep, Sean's also got in his hand here. Let me see if I can show it. He's got these MM pieces. And these are old school. I wouldn't recommend eating that M&M in there, no. that pile of M&Ms, but, Just no. but the wild thing roller coaster, that's actually pretty neat. But with all these in here, these are cool pieces. So I can't wait to get these listed um, and just see what we can get for them and make some room and start getting some of this stuff out of here. But as you can tell, we have bin after bin of toys, Skylanders, all kinds of stuff that we need to go through and finalize and either relist or finally get listed in bundles to go through. Oh, Troy really loves this piece, hold on. She had this up in her store when we were doing the store. Uh, this fruit here, let's see if I can pull him out. We think he is so cool. Sean, hit the button for me. sell things like motorcycle helmets wrestle figures this is just an endless pile oh i still have this piece now i wish this was in better condition but i have the old school batman and it actually comes apart where it's the single shell in the middle so i know it wasn't a lot of great detail but as you can see you can see my pile of death in here um whereas my buddy over on tesla pickers channel he says it's a living pile a live pile so I think we're going to start using that with him and I'm going to let him know that we're going to adopt that one as well. I like that better. But as far as this video, this is our soy pod video. Um, show us yours, show us what you got. And we look forward to seeing you on the next time. And remember, stay hungry and keep up the hustle.